Well, today is gonna be a uh, Costco day. Yeah, so today is Costco day. <laughs> Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Wemimo and I'm also known as Dat Mama 5 and also known as TMO5 Candle Co. Welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing? Um, it's been a while that I've posted a video. Is that right? I think so. Well, as you all well, today is gonna be uh Costco day. Yeah, so today is Costco day. I did went in March, but I think I was really really busy so I didn't have the chance to um, film that video and the reason was because when I went in there most of the food items I would normally buy they don't have it like they don't have the five dozen eggs that I would normally buy they don't have the carnation meal because I try I buy the 12 in the pack they do not have any in stock I mean they do not have quite a lot of things in there so it for me it was more or less like a wasted trip for me so hence why I was not motivated to kind of like film what I got for the month of March from Costco however if you are interested in the things that I shop once a month from Costco I'm gonna leave a card to my playlist of Costco shopping so you have an idea of how I shop for my family of seven yeah we're family of seven so how I shop for my family of seven most especially when I go to Costco and as you also know when I go to Costco as well I only go to Costco once a month and I go in there to get groceries such as uh, milk household things like eggs milk evaporated milk sweet corn like in packs and um, when it comes to African food I don't buy chicken or beef or anything like that I don't buy stuff like that from Costco at all you all know I go to African shop for that and if you are interested in the items or stuff that I get from my African shop as well I'm gonna leave the card to um, the place of my African food shopping as well how I shop for a family of seven as well the things I buy and how I buy them and also to kind of like give a guide as to you know the price points that I pay for stuff anyway that's that all over so I'm in my madame outfit today <laughs> I was at work yesterday which was Saturday covering an overtime and luckily one of the surgeons were like you know what guys it's Ramadan I brought a lot of food to feed 25 people so feel free to go into the tea room and help yourself and I had the most delicious curry yesterday it was it tasted absolutely good you know it was pepperish there was lots of pepper in there and I could see a few of the colleagues saying whoosh whoosh effing hot effing hot effing hot whoosh whoosh I was just laughing my head up because I'm used to like the spice and food being hot so yeah and I thought no why not just mm -hmm. and today is Palm Sunday as well yeah you can tell I'm not in church today I just felt no I need to do this because um, the kids are on um, Easter holiday as well they are off for two weeks and yesterday because i was quite tired i was not able to cook my son my second son were like mommy can we order pizza and i was like who's gonna pay for it um maybe i'll ask the girls not knowing that his dad already cooked i didn't even know that my husband already prepared their beans so i was like so later on i noticed that my husband already prepared beans so i was like so there's beans in the house and this boy is asking me to order pizza so for him that's a sign that he is more about you know ordering food and i'm not about that life so that's why i say no i'm going to go to costco today get all the food supplies in the house and let them eat as good as i am this month of april a month before my birthday mm -mm, no eating out we got to save all that coin so anyway guys i don't want to bore you i'm going to go now and go into costco after costco i'm going to go into tesco to pick up a few things as well and as you know how i do i go do the shopping and then i come back and talk you through the things i got and how much i spent and your girl i'm going with a list so no buying out of this list i might but i'm being i'm going to be guided by this list so that's that anyway guys i will see you when i get back from my shop all right guys i've just arrived at costco and i'm trying to get few let me see if i can flip this camera so there's a queue there's a queue going on here i was actually i've bought this few since last week but i decided i'm gonna get it this one because the way my husband was going on oh he just left the car he didn't put petrol in the car and stuff like that so i'm here now i'm just in the queue waiting to get fuel so you can see costco at the back there that's the store there so i just want to get fuel and i think the petrol is quite cheaper here at costco as compared to tesco's or if i don't buy petrol here i buy at tesco so i think 
Tesco's and Costco they are a bit similar in price I'm not sure but I think so yeah so touch base with you guys later we are moving hi everyone so that's me back from Costco and honestly when I was trying to get in there it was kind of like traffic slow traffic and i think the traffic was coming from people who were trying to buy fuel and i was trying to buy petrol as well so i was in the queue for about two three four five minutes and then it kind of like moved pretty much quicker so that's me back now i've got all of my groceries here i'll try and maybe show you at some point so in order not to make this video too long i'm going to snap a picture of the receipt so you guys can compare or check the price or I'm going to talk through all of these things and then once I'm editing this video, I'll try and pop the cost of each product as I go along because normally where I do it before, I will look for the item and tell you the price straight away but this time around, I'm just going to talk about the products and then when I'm editing, I'll pop the price in there so like I said earlier on when I was going, Costco do not allow filming I don't know why it's that way in Scotland but I believe out of Scotland, people like content creators could take camera everywhere but in scotland they are just different anyways then and also if you're new to my channel as well i've got a playlist of all of my costco shop all i'll leave a card somewhere here so you can have an idea of the things i buy and some of the some of the things that i just kind of like randomly buy but i have certain things that i buy um when i go to costco first of all one of the reasons why i went to costco was because of eggs however i think there's a shortage of egg in the uk at present i remember i went to lidl during the weekday and i tried to buy three packs of egg i was told i can only buy two so when i went to costco to do there was none and the guy at the cashier said to me that yes there's been a shortage of eggs so they are now rationing eggs anyways i was able to pick up a few from tesco there so that's a different video i'll show you what i picked up in tesco and stuff like that so this video is just about what i picked up at costco so let's start i picked up this um sparkling water as you all know I drink sparkling water. I don't drink anything else. I, it's just for me. Some people are like, oh, why do you like sparkling water? For me, I'm that kind of species that does not like still water. Anything I drink has to be sparkly. So that's why I always go for sparkling water anytime I go into Costco. So I'll put the price at some point on the screen. And I also bought this um, Mula yogurt as well. I got this Mula yogurt because I like it. My kids love it. So yeah, I decided to buy two of these. And also, like I said earlier, on the kids are on two weeks um, Easter holiday break, so yeah, we need food in there. So I bought two of these as well. And then I bought this pack of cheddar cheese, um, mini cheddar biscuit. I love it. And also for my kids, especially my 11 year old, she's constantly eating. Like, she's constantly eating. Anytime she goes into the kitchen, she's going to come out with something. So I just bought this as well. And these are most of the things I buy monthly. These Richmond sausages, my kids love them. I barely eat them, but my kids love them. So I picked two of this up at Costco. And I also picked up this um, bacon pack also from Costco as well. It's got six in it and each pack weighs 200. So each pack like this weighs 250. So then I've got six in here. So my kids love bacon as well. And I bought this evaporated milk. Last time I went to Costco, they they were out of stock. Uh, out of stock, so I bought two of it. There's one here, and this is the second pack. So I bought two packs of this. I don't drink much of this milk. My husband is the culprit. Is one who drink this milk most of the time with his tea. So that's that. I bought two of those. I bought this diluting juice also, and I've only just started buying this diluting juice because I just noticed that the little drinks in the packs it's starting to get very expensive now and my kids use it as play piece so like you know rather than buying those I can, this is actually saving money they just need a little bit of this and then they had water to it so that's that so i picked two as well and then you know every time i go to costco i always buy hot chocolate so i bought this cadre one i decided to buy one because my kids drink it as if there's no tomorrow so i only bought one this time around and then i bought this skippy peanut butter yeah, I bought just the one, so I'll, I'll pop the price somewhere there for you. I also bought this um, Kellogg's Frosties. 
I love Kellogg gun I use when I used to eat frosts every day. So I bought these two packs and a pack is um now hundred and twenty five grams each. If you know the cost of this compared to how much they sell one in in supermarket, you would prefer to go to Costco. So I bought two packs of this. I also bought this um huge pack of kitten tissue. So yeah, from Kitten Tissue, I've been buying from Farm Food lately and they're quite expensive. I just need a sharp knife. A sharp knife, I watch a video on TikTok where the mom just half it so it lasts longer. So I need to shop for a sharp knife so that this will last longer as well. And I also bought um, toilet tissue as well. So pick this up as well. Also from Costco, it's much more money saving when you buy it at Costco as compared to when you buy it at the supermarket. So that's that there. And you know my nando sauce i love this nando sauce perinis nando sauce i love this so i picked that up as well i buy this most of the time when i go to costco and then butter it's much more cheaper at costco as compared to supermarket so i picked two the last time i went to costco i think i picked four so we've still got two we've still got one in the freezer one in the fridge and this is going to go in the freezer as well so now my kids have been making their packed lunches to school because I refuse to be paying £3.50 for any meal deal at Tesco or any supermarket for lunch. So I decided to buy this. Normally I've been buying this single pack of um, tuna. So I found this huge um, one at um, Costco. As well. So I picked two. So if we open this up, we can always decant it into salty water and put it in the fridge. And each time they need it, they can just you know take the amount they need and you know make their packed lunch. So I bought two of those as well. I also bought a pack of these prawns. You know, each time I go to Costco, I always buy a prawn. So from the last time I went to Costco, we still got a pack in the freezer and I just decided to buy another one. So now we now have two. So I bought one as well. And I bought this pack of um breakfast mini. What's it called? Breakfast mini. So they're like just like um we snacks for breakfast but in my house this will go down at any time it does not necessarily have to be at breakfast or anytime so i bought those as well and then i got this recycled bean bag if you know how much they sell bean bag at supermarket my best deal was at costco so i bought this huge one and it's got it's got 90 in it and they are quite massive so there we go i also bought um Cocoa Pops, these are for my kids. I eat Cocoa Pops at times as well. So I picked two packs of these as well. And one box is um, 650 grams. So in total, four boxes that I've got there. And I also picked up um, Crunchy Nuts as well. Let me show you guys. I picked up Crunchy Nuts as well. So this, I'm sure we've still got quite a lot in the cupboard there. So I've not bought uh, more than this. So I only bought this one pack. And each of the pack is one kg. So yeah, it's gonna last us a wee while. And I also got these um, chicken wings as well. Um, I've been enjoying it each time I buy it from Costco. I think it's the third time I bought it. So I just, anytime I cook jollof rice or maybe I just want a snack, I just pop this in the oven and make it, and just prepare it up and then we just eat as much as you want. So that's that. And then I picked up another can of um, tomato. So I've still got a full pack from the last time I went to Costco. So I decided to pick another one up and that's that. And I also picked up um, a pack of um, green giant sweet corn just because like I said, my kids have started making their own pack lunch to school now. And I just feel that these are the things. I mean, I did, if you look at the sandwiches they sell in the supermarket, if you look at what is inside it, tuna, ham, all those blah 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 blah. I can as well make, buy all those things and then they can make their own lunch to their own preference, like the way they want it. So that's that there. And I think that's pretty much everything I picked up at Costco, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, like I said, I went there for eggs, but they've not got any. So I think there's a shortage of eggs everywhere. So in total, um excluding that, in total, no, so before I put it in total, I bought petrol so there was um fuel in the car and then i filled up um 32 liters of petrol and that cost me for the four pounds and um, 33 pence so that's for fuel so my total shopping for food excluding fuel and excluding that 
was 206 pounds 82 pence so if i had the vat on top of that that is 216 pounds 61 pence so all of these items i've showed you right now they all cost 216 pounds 61 pence and if i had the cost of the petrol all together um, amounts to 261 pounds 15 pence so that's my monthly shop for um from costco for a family of seven and like i said this is going to last us a wee while some of these things might go quicker but the cereal the plum the sweet corn the milk the sausage the bacon it will last us a while till when next i go in may so yeah that's the end of my costco haul for the month of april and it's to the total of 261 pounds 15 pence and that's including petrol and see with the way that petrol is i think hopefully that petrol should last us about two weeks or three weeks most of the time we only use the car for church and me for work so that's pretty much how far we travel we don't really travel far much so i'm hoping now at the full tank it should last us a while anyway this is the end of my video i hope you've enjoyed this um costco haul if it's something you enjoy watching do let me know in the comment section if there's something else you want me to showcase on my channel do let me know and if you have watched till now and you're yet to like this video what are you waiting for so don't forget to like drop a comment in the comment section like is there scarcity of eggs in your area as well and if there is scarcity of eggs drop a link an exo of where you are getting lots of eggs because we need lots of eggs like we hit lots of eggs in my house and if you're yet to subscribe as well don't forget to hit the subscribe button turn on the post notification and share this video and don't forget to join my membership as well you know i've been seeing people like they are dropping me comments in the comment section or they have been DMing me asking me about questions like if you don't join my membership i'm sorry those questions you are asking me i won't be able to answer them so it's mainly for the benefit of those who join my membership anyway happy easter in advance and i hope to catch up with you in my next video all right bye